One, two, three o'clock, four o'clock, rock. We're going to rock around the clock tonight. But... Hi, and welcome to 45's A Life in the Groove with your host, Bob Wilde. What sparked your interest in rock and roll music? Like everybody else, we just listened to the radio. This is uh, going back early 50s, really. <laughs> I'm a older fella. Alice Faye was one of my favorite singers, uh, and the mood of the music was very sweet. You're sweet if there ever was one. Rock and roll was just starting to come in. Alan Freed was just coming on. The Moon Dog Show, he was uh, called. He came in from Cleveland and uh, became the biggest disc jockey for the rock and roll era. Let's all dance now as those cool cats pick up their tenor horns to wail. Sam the Man Taylor, Count Hastings and King Curtis and a little campus rumpus. The most radio and most people never heard before, including myself. And I got uh, attached to uh, listening to the, uh, the harmonies, the doo-wops and uh, words that made no sense. and. Uh, all these great groups, the Spaniels, the Valentines, all the other bird groups, the Orioles. Sonny Till and the Orioles, he had a, uh, a song and a beautiful record that just took my heart away and probably still lives inside me. Uh, you saw me crying in the chapel. You saw me crying in the chapel. Well, anyway, that swept me right off my feet. So I became a big uh, uh, listener to uh, the rhythm and blues and the doo-wop and uh, the way the guitars were starting to sound. So my foundation was being built without me knowing it, that uh, this was more than just being a teenager. And uh, we were all starting to listen to the same music and talk, talk the same language to each other. Hey, that's cool, man. <laughs> well, that's cool, baby. I mean, you know how it is, rocking and rolling. What's up? I'm hip. And hip means cool. I mean, whatever the expressions were, and then we would see it being reflected in like Life Magazine and Look Magazine, that this generation, meaning us, our haircuts, our longer hair, sideburns, uh, our style of clothing, the way we went to dance, the style of dancing. Uh, was having an effect on uh, on a culture, and we were the in the vanguard of it. 